Hello students. Students, today uh, we are uh, initializing exercise 2.3, question number 1. In this question, we need to find the remainder when this equation x cube plus 3x square plus 3x plus 1 is divided by this one, right? So, we need to write this in the place of uh, divisor, right? And this one in the place of dividend. 3x square plus 3x plus 1 I will write the quotient here right so uh, now uh, you should know that when we do need this one x cube right so uh, x cube so we have to you know uh, factorize it sort of so this x, one x we are having so we would be multiplying it with x square and we will get x cube and this one is again multiplied with 1 also so it will uh, you know uh, give the, give us this answer now uh, to subtract we need to change the signs here and this will be cancelled and 3x minus x is 2x square just copy uh, you know the remaining ones also downwards so that it is easier for us to know that this is remaining now we need 2x square so 1x is we are having here so it is uh, you know we just need this one to get this one and uh, 2x right so let's change the signs this will be cancelled and 3 minus 2x is x and the one uh, we just drop it down here okay now this one is multiplied with the you know 1 then we'll get the answer x plus 1 now changing the signs this will be cancelled this will be cancelled and the remainder will be 0 i hope you got this now this this method is called long division right so we need to find the remainder with the help of the long division okay now what's the second one now second one is we need to divide this uh, the same equation with x minus 1 upon 2 okay so this is you know the upon ones are the student feel you know a bit confusing in this one but there is no confusion at all i tell you uh, one thing how we got this how we got this okay let me tell you the system so that it will be easier for us to calculate this one now we are to multiply this with any number like say it is you know x we are multiplying this one x with any number say y to get this one x cube okay so we need to find this the value of this one then okay x cube uh, multiply by 1 upon x so this is cancelled by this one it is square so we got this we got this so we we put it here right it is pretty easy you just have to assume any variable other variable to find a quotient now take it as a quotient right we are finding the quotient here we are multiplying this with the quotient to get the dividend right simple so here we are having x1 so we need to multiply this x with any number so that we get this we know this we it is pretty easy right the problem will be you know we'll be stuck over here so uh, this uh, system I told you just now is to solve this issue okay now this is x so x into x square x into uh, sorry x into x square we get x cube we got it so but the thing is that you know minus minus half so minus half when we multiply by this we get you know minus x square upon 2 minus x square upon 2 okay now we're gonna change the signs of both of them so that they may be cancelled and subtracted but here the signs are positive both signs are equal so they will be you know uh, added okay now i must uh, you know solve this thing so that you get the solution of this okay now this is uh, 3x uh, 3 should i solve it here or uh, here here uh, take it as a rough so 3 x square plus x upon 2 fine okay 
so we need to take the LCM of it right so it is you know 5x or uh, sorry 6x multi this multiplied by this so it is 6x square plus x square upon 2 so it is 7 upon 2 so here, let's write it here 7 upon 2x square plus 3x plus 1 now the remainders here we gonna write it this way so now what we want is we want 7 upon 2 now we gonna multiply with this with any some number uh, x square so it will be you know uh, 7 upon 2x now we got this 7 upon 2x square and this will be multiplied by this numerator with numerator and denominator with denominator so we will get minus 7 upon 4 x now here also we gonna change the sign so that this will be cancelled and this will be added or subtracted something like that so this is uh, again i must tell you okay i uh, let me tell you the side it is uh, 3x plus 7 upon 4x so this will be multiplied with this uh, 3 1 so it will be uh, 12x plus 7 x upon 4 it will be 19 upon 4 so let's write here 19 upon 4 x plus 1 okay now what we need to multiply uh, this with any number so that we get this so it will be just you know we are having x so it will be 19 upon 4 plus 19 upon 4 so it will be like this then this will be multiplied by this numerator with numerator denominator with denominator so it will be uh minus 19 upon 8 <coughs> okay now let's draw a line here and change the signs of both of them this will be cancelled and this will be what see 1 plus 19 upon 8 so this will be multiplied and gone above so it was the 8 8 plus 8 plus 19 it's 27 upon 8 so this is the remainder here I hope you got this now you need to write that therefore the remainder is 27 upon 8 right okay now this is the third question so the divisor is given here and we need to find the remainder uh, when we will divide this uh, with this one right okay so let's start with it now uh, if we need this x cube so what will we you know doing here we just need x square we'll get x cube here then we will uh, you know change the sign of it and then subtract so this is the remainder till now so we need this now 3x square so on multiplying uh, 3x x with 3x we will get 3x square again changing the signs and it will be you know this one now these are the remainders okay so now we need a 3x so we will multiply x with 3 so we'll get 3x right change the signs and cancel it and the remainder here is uh, 1 uh, let's not put the sign so the remainder is one so you just write down the remainder is one here right okay now the next uh, the next part fourth it is x plus pi okay so this is a divisor given here and uh, you know the dividend is the same as the previous one so it is 3x square plus 3x plus 1 and the divisor is x plus pi so let's solve this one now okay it is complicated a bit complicated i mean for the students who haven't experienced it before but uh, anyhow we'll do it with perfection so nothing to worry about now what we need here is x cube and we are having x here so what is lacking it's x square is lacking so x into x cube x square will get x cube right now uh, here comes pi okay so pi with x square we will you know get pi x square now we gonna change uh, the signs of both of them and this is cancelled so this we are uh, now we are to subtract here this one so i must tell you one thing here 
that we are subtracting 3x square minus pi x square fine this one so let's take x square common here so 3 minus pi x square this will make the quotient bit easier right okay so we will write this one as the remainder x square and we'll just you know uh, take these also downwards as the remainder so it will uh, make us easier and it will help us in doing no mistake at all now what we need here is we need here 3 minus pi and x square right 3 minus pi and x square so we are having x here so uh, we might be you know uh, we need this one because one x we are having here we just need x uh, to x square so one we will have here so we'll get x square and now this gonna multiply with this one also so uh, we'll be having you know three minus it's pretty easy okay so don't get panic now 3 minus pi and pi x here because this is this and this will be multiplied by this to get this whole of it so it will be pi and x pi x and this one also along with it so now we gonna change the signs of it this will be cancelled all of it and this will uh, we'll just write it here 3 minus uh, okay let me explain you this also so this uh, whatever is outside the bracket uh, you know multiplies with the inside so let's draw a box here and solve it so it is uh, this multiply by this you get 3 pi x minus and this is pi square x you get this right and from this one we are to subtract this one 3x uh, sorry from 3x we gonna subtract this one so let's put 3x here minus like this so now out of these three 3x minus 3 pi x minus pi x pi square x what is common we can can we take anything common here um, yeah I think we can take um, x common here mm. yeah <clears throat> okay let's take x common uh, then what will be left 3 minus 3 pi minus pi square now this will be left if we take x common if we take x common this will be left 3 minus 3 pi minus x square okay now what we need is you know we are having x here and we are we have uh, you know this is the result here so 3 minus 3 pi uh, minus pi square x this is the uh, we have subtracted both of them and plus one here uh, this one right so now we need this and we are having one x we are having x so we need this one so let's write it here uh, it is uh, there's a bit less space so uh, just try to understand or uh, you know 3 minus 3 pi minus x square sorry pi square now this is the third uh, quotient the final quotient that we have done here we were requiring this thing so on multiplying x with this we will get this 3 minus 3 pi minus pi square multiplied with x we got this now this and this is okay and now this is going to uh, you know has been multiplied by this also so let's write this plus 3 minus 3 pi minus pi square and it is uh, now this thing is multiplied by pi so we got this now let's uh, change the signs of it so this thing whole of this thing whole of this thing is cancelled with this one so what is left is this one so it is 
let's write it here 1 minus 3 minus 3 pi minus pi square x this is left or you can say or 1 minus 3x minus 3 pi x minus pi square x now this is the uh, thing left here sorry it, it is pi so not x so it will be pi cube and it will be square uh, okay let me do it again so it is 1 minus 3 pi minus 3 pi square minus pi cube because it is uh, pi I thought it is x uh, it's okay so this is the remainder right so you can write the statement here okay uh, now this one this one is visible 1 minus 3 pi minus 3 pi square minus pi cube okay you can write the statement here that uh, the remainder is this fine